I'm just making beans and cornbread this night and I just used canned beans. I used two cans of mixed and two cans of pintos and then you're going to add one can of water and you're going to bring that to a boil for about 15 minutes and then reduce the heat. I'm just going to peel and cut some potatoes for some fried potatoes. And after I peel and cut them, I'll wash them. Then I'm just going to add some salt and pepper to the potatoes and you can add as much as you like. This is just a perfect. Now you're going to see me stick my cast iron skillet into the oven to preheat it for my cornbread. Then I'm going to make the cornbread. It's one cup of milk, half a cup of flour, one egg, and that egg was super hard to crack. And then I do about a third a cup of milk and about a fourth a cup of oil. That night, I really don't know. I just sort of did it. I didn't really measure it out. And then you're just going to mix it all together. And... You're going to let your skillet preheat in the oven for 10 minutes and then once it's done you'll pour your cornbread mix into the skillet and bake it for about 20 minutes on 450 degrees. Now I'm going to make kraut and wieners or whatever you'd like to call it. And I use these New Orleans hot dogs and they were actually really good. It was the first time I ever tried it. So if you would like, I suggest you try it. It is very good. You will see me making stuffed peppers. You will need some bell peppers, a can of tomato sauce, a good squirt of mustard, 
salt and pepper to taste, two large eggs, an onion, and some ground beef. Now you're just gonna see me wash and cut the bell peppers in half.
just going to fill the peppers with the meat. I'm just going to cover the stuffed peppers with aluminum foil and then I will place them in the oven. I'm going to bake them on 350 for about an hour and a half. Guys, I was just going to let you all know that today's video is going to be super short because some things happened and I ended up not cooking on one night and then one night I went out to eat and I totally missed to film that for y'all and I forgot all about it. So I apologize, but I'm just going to go ahead and upload this and y'all can see I only cooked two nights. But anyway, sorry. Don't forget to subscribe.